Given the function f of x equals x squared plus 1 divided by x minus 2, let's calculate its horizontal asymptotes. A horizontal asymptote is a horizontal straight line which, when drawing the function, the, the function never ever get to touch this straight line. We can see that the limit of f where of x when x approaches infinite is equals a value. Let's say that the straight line goes through b, it would be b. So the equation for this straight line would be y equals b. So a horizontal asymptote y equals b appears when the limit approaching infinite is b. Let's calculate the limit when x approaches infinite. If we obtain a real number, that's the horizontal asymptote. It is the limit of x squared plus 1 divided by x minus 2 when x approaches infinite. To calculate the limit, as it is a quotient of polynomial, we just have to divide everything by the x with the highest exponent, whether in the numerator or the denominator. In the numerator, the exponent is 2, and on the denominator is 1, so we divide by x squared. And we have x squared divided by x squared plus 1 divided by x squared divided by x divided by x squared minus 2 divided by x squared. This is equals to 1 plus 1 divided by x squared on the numerator and on the denominator it would be 1 divided by x minus 2 divided by x squared. Now as x approaches infinite, everything that is divided by x is equals 0. So we end with 1 plus 0 divided by 0 minus 0. This is 1 divided by 0. As we know, this kind of fractions, a number divided by 0, are, are allowed to, you, to be used with limits. And it means that a number divided by something really really small, nearly zero, the, the result of this fraction is an extremely big number, infinite. So, have we obtained a value when x approaches infinite? No, we've obtained infinite, not a real number, and this means that the function doesn't have horizontal asymptotes